Hello, everybody, and welcome to a another news update. Seems like there's lots of news lately in the business side of light novels recently. Today, Yen On has announced that they have partnered with Hashit Audio. If you aren't aware, Hashit is actually one of the parent companies of Yen Press slash Yen On, and they are going to be producing audiobooks of some of their light novel titles. So uh, we do have a full press release. I'll post that. Uh, it's on EnglishLightNovels.com. I'll post a link to that in the description down below. Just taking a little segment from here, Yen Audio will launch four debut titles in summer and fall 2021. The first volume of Solo Leveling, a South Korean novel by Chu Gong, originally published online in serial releases on the basis of the best-selling webtoon of the same name. Uh, the second release will take place in August, and that will be the initial volume of Sword Art Online, of course by Reiki Kawahara. And then they will also be releasing in the fall Overlord and the Saga of Tanya the Evil. Additionally, they are also going to be releasing The Miracles of the Nemea General Store, which is a uh, one-off novel. Uh, most of these are going to be running around seven and a half to a maximum of 10 hours. Uh, solo leveling uh, is nine and a half hours. Saga of Tanya the Evil Volume 1 is 10 hours, just to kind of give you an idea. So they're in the, all in that range within seven and a half to 10 hours. These are not going to be uh, cut in any way. These will be uncut. Uh, so they will be the entirety of the book. Still no word yet whether this is going to be sort of a radio play type style where you have numerous voices doing parts in the book or whether it is going to be a single narrator. Now, Hachette uh, Audio Group, they've actually won Grammy Awards for their audiobooks. Uh, they do not typically do more than a single narrator on their audiobooks. They are not really known for doing radio play style. Uh, so my guess, and again, this is strictly a guess, is that this will be a single narrator who will probably work across an entire series. I imagine there will be a different narrator for each of the series. And uh, that is where we are right now. Currently, Solo Leveling, both Volumes 1 and 2, are set to get audiobooks. Uh, Sword Art Online, same thing, Volumes 1 and 2. Overlord, Volume 1 and 2. Right now, we only have Saga of Tanya the Evil 1 listed. So, uh, tentatively, we're seeing the first Volume 1s being released, as they said in the press release, between uh, July and and October-ish. Uh, then we will see actually Saga of Tanya the Evil, they're saying is in November, and then Overlord Volume 2, Sword Art Online, uh, later volumes, you're all looking at that sort of towards the end of the year. So, uh, kind of interesting. Uh, I know that there are a number, number of people who already take advantage of the uh, Kindle's ability to read books aloud, However, this obviously is going to offer a probably much more rewarding experience, seeing as how you're going to be having it performed as opposed to just a computer reading it. And obviously for accessibility, for people that uh, have a hard time seeing, uh, this is gonna be pretty cool. And it's just another way that light novels can be enjoyed by different groups of people doing different things. Uh, so interesting, very interesting. Now, this is not the first time that light novels have received a audiobook treatment. Uh, Vertical slash now Kodansha Books uh, did do this with a couple of volumes of the Monogatari series from Nishio Ishin. However, they did do the route of having several people doing the audiobook, so they actually had uh, each of the characters had a different voice actor. Uh, so, Again, it'll be interesting to see whether Yen decides to copy that since that's already been done as an audio book of a light novel title or whether they are going to stick with sort of how Hashit has done their audio books in the past, which is a single narrator. In any case, what do you all think? Uh, let me know in the comments down below. And of course, if there's any other news or 
interesting uh, industry type stuff, I will let you know. In the meantime, thank you so much for listening to this and uh, give it a thumbs up, subscribe. You know the routine. I'll see you in the next video. Bye-bye for now.